just a quick show what I got here I'm gonna put on this battery and by the way don't go buy these gauges they put on here cuz I got 54 volts and it's still showing full and it's way low not way low but it's low I mean maybe if it's for 52 volt then it starts going down but I haven't gotten it below 52 so I'm not gonna probably anyhow yeah I never go by that I check it with the meter all the time anyway to make sure I don't I pretty much know how far I can go and what I got so here's a converter I'm putting on here because this one doesn't have an outlet to run the device off of the battery I can charge my batteries and stuff these are balancing out here but yeah so I'm gonna put a XT30 here on here and this is gonna go to the battery with this here and this is a like a spark arrester for when you plug it in the battery this with the green stripe you can tell that's the type of XT90 connector this is anti-spark so yeah I'm gonna put that on with this so that I can charge my batteries and it says because with this battery when it's in the off position it's still showing 21 volts coming out of it so go figure anyhow <laughs> so this thing is good for over 20 20 to 60 volts and it brings it down to 12 3 amp max yep little converter here that's waterproof too it's sealed up with epoxy so I'll probably Stick that in the bag there after I solder it all up and uh, just have the uh, this thing hanging out here with the with the little cover on it so when I need it I can plug in my device with that or I can plug in my charger with that and that's that yeah little uh, thing it's cheap I forget a few dollars five dollars six dollars I got a couple of them anyhow 